man, I don't know, like amazing or just uh, freedom. It's just, it's one word, it's, it's difficult. going to be a two hour drive ended up being a four hour drive due to traffic but I finally made it to Button Willow. This is my second time here, first time for motorcycles. I'm going to see if I can get a drone shot from up above and then let's go ahead and start some of the, uh, the cinematic shots that we all know and love. Alright, let's get it. <laughs> be my first time sleeping in my car got the whole mattress surprisingly fit pretty well not gonna lie it's squished but i think it'll fit pretty well i'm six foot eight so we'll see how well this sleeps tonight i think it'll be pretty good i'll just crack the windows make sure i don't suffocate and uh, yeah I'll let you guys know how it goes in the morning good morning it's currently 7 a.m on sunday and can't complain i'm living the dream i'm gonna eat some breakfast real quick get my gear set up and then i think everybody's getting their bike set up at the moment and uh get some of those shots rolling out that i promised <laughs> let's go the truth is like there's nowhere else where you can, I don't know, find out where your limits are like you can here safely. Uh, and when you get in the groove out here, that feeling is something. Ooh. Uh, you know, okay, usually my favorite thing about track days, is it's the same thing as my favorite thing about motorcycles, is the camaraderie. Everybody here is trying to take care of everybody. Everybody here is trying to make everybody a better rider. There are some exceptions to that rule, um, but hopefully at most track days, that's that's the case. And honestly, from the very first time I came to the track, um, which was a few years ago on my, on, on my R1, I came out like a squid. I had a backpack with some tools and that was it. And I rode my bike out here from LA. And literally I got into Button Willow, like three or four guys came up to me were like, hey, you can share, share space in our tent, you can share space in our garage, here's tools if you need it, like whatever you need kind of thing. Uh, and that's always been the thing. I try to pass that forward and everybody's always like that. They're always making sure everybody gets as many sessions and as good of a day as possible. That's hard to beat in the world, period. Hanging out with my friends and going fast and, and not having to worry about a car pulling out in front of you. You know, anything else that could happen at the street, getting tickets, um, hitting a guardrail. Out here, you know, you have accidents. I actually had an accident yesterday. I broke some ribs, I think. I'm in a lot of pain, but stuff happens. But uh, on the street, that would have been a lot worse. Uh, I don't ride street anymore. I only do the track. Lost a dear friend. And uh, you know, the more I started riding the street, I, I mean, I met some of the greatest people. Some, uh, some of them are out here. And uh, riding with them was, was a blast. I wouldn't, I wouldn't take it back. But uh, the more you ride on the street, the more people you meet. and. Um, you know, you just hear about these stories about, you know, somebody wasn't looking, somebody got, uh, you know, somebody got hit by a car, somebody low sided it, hit the wall or something like that. So uh, I just thought, you know, I'd rather, you know, go out to the track, uh, get all my energy out there. If I slide out or something, um, at least I'll go in the dirt or, you know, and there's an ambulance there, so it's safer. Eight years. 2018 is eight years. I got my first bike in 2010. Uh, CBR 1000, RR 2012, Fireblade. Track for sure. Just because I can let loose. There's no. You know. Coming with a goal. And beating, and like like this weekend, I beat my personal best time, and that was what I came here to do, and I did it.
amazing or just uh, freedom. It's just, it's one word, it's, it's difficult. Mm, I would say compare it to the sex. <laughs> the word fear, but like not in a sense of being scared, but like, like you start the weekend scared and then by the end of it, you've conquered fear, you know? So fear would definitely probably be the word.